Welcome back to more of the Game of Blind with Sam of Am Let's Play of Darkest Dungeon. We're going back in the cove. And this might look like a... Actually, it's not even remotely a similar team to what it looked like last time. I was going to say, looks might look, might look like a slightly similar team to what it was last time. It's actually a completely different team. So, I mean, we have Bounty Hunter in the front, but we're finally going to get to try to actually level up our damn um, Shield Breaker. Because I gave her some new moves, because... She had two moves that only worked in the front row, and she didn't really have many ways of getting up to the front row. So I decided to change her moveset a little bit around. We have our uh, Grave Robber, whose moveset I also decided to change up a bit, so she doesn't move around as much as she did before. And we have our Vestal, who is going to... Vestal's going to Vestal. That's pretty much all we've got that we can say about her. Okay, we give him trinkets, right? Yep, we got all the Feather Crystals on everybody, because I like getting that extra speed. Okay, so this is a medium quest. I have to remember that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to buy out the shovels. You never know what you're going to get in the uh, in the cove. Let's see. I probably don't need too many of these items, but I'm going to take them anyway. Six of these is probably plenty. Four keys is too much for the cove, I think. Three is enough. I don't think we need any. Um, holy waters, quite frankly. I'm going to take a couple more torches than usual, just because I usually tend to run out pretty easy, pretty early on in these sorts of things. You know, let's just, let's just take, let's just take that. That's fine. Okay. Just go. Just go. It's fine. Everything's going to be fine. I keep telling myself that. I should mention, although I don't really know if I, I know I don't have to mention this sort of thing, but... I was going to do some, I was going to do a different recording thing today, but uh, that was changed another day. And uh, so we're here, and we're playing this game instead. Well, I wasn't going to be a game I was going to be doing. Uh, okay, 100% of room battles. So I think this is a pretty clear thing what we need to do. We're going to go up and to the left, then backtrack and go right, down, right, and up, and left. And that should that should cover everything. So there's only like one little hallway we won't go down, and we don't have to go down hallways, so we should be fine. And we don't have an antiquarian with us, so I don't need to worry about having a specific character selected uh, when I'm opening up any and all items. Pretty sure I had some characters with like 10 speed, but yeah, okay, sure, that's fine. Uh, she can totally go first. Makes perfect sense to me. I shouldn't have done that. I immediately regret doing that every single time I do it. <laughs> Uh, poison Arch for three blight. You know what? Let's let's give that a try. It's still it's still seven damage overall. That's not bad. But now he's gonna do this. Yikes. Okay, that's fine. Hmm. Puncture. What is this do? Okay, I need to look at this for a second. So bypasses guard. Right. That's why I took that. Okay. I forgot why I took that as a thing. <laughs> let's see. Mm. Let's just do a... I guess we'll just do a pierce on this guy? Cool. That works. Oh. I had another character still to do things. <laughs> Alright, let's heal you up a bit. Yeah. This is gonna work. I'll keep telling myself that. Let's see, what do I want to do here? She is... Marked. So let's attack him. Didn't quite work the way I'd hoped it would, but that's okay. What? Okay. That's fine. She's going to say, like, why are we not getting a chance to go? But it'll be fine. No problem. Now, I think Adder's Kiss does do... Oh, no. That's... Am I thinking of the wrong attack that I... Did I use? Did I take the wrong attack off of her? I swear this something did more damage versus blighted. Is it the wrong move that I have, or that I was thinking of? I don't know. Which one was it? it wasn't that one? Oh no. Which one was it? I swear a move that I had did extra damage. Was it this one? Oh, it was the one that I didn't take, of course. Uh, of course, 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 it's fine. Oh, I can't even use it. Not only it's the fine, whatever. You know what? Just get rid of her. Give them no quarter. 
I'm bad at this game. At least I admit it. Alright. Let's just leave her in the front for the moment. Hey. A map that I'm actually going to be able to use. Or make use of, I guess. Cool. Oh, she's still going, huh? <laughs> that went quite a ways. Okay. So we do have to go up here. It's fine. I was expecting to have to go that way anyway. So no big deal. I like that map, though. There's a... There's a uh, Impressive amount of coverage. Unfortunately, now we have to deal with bugs. And I did not want to have to do that. Okay. Not bad. Ooh. What do I want to do here? Let's attack the closest. Okay, that's great. Let's see. Flashing daggers. I hope we'll get rid of the. Nope. HP away, as usual. Let's see. There's Kiss. Sure. Wow, that did a lot of damage. And he's gonna die from Blight. I did a lot more damage than I was expecting to do, but holy crap. I didn't see if that was like a, a plus damage. Uh, okay, fine. Get Blighted. That's fine. Oh boy. Damn it. And I have no blood with me. Okay. Okay, game. Have it your way. I was really hoping I'd get rid of that one. Well, what do I even want to do here? Maybe I should not have done that now that I think about it. Hmm. Groovy. Okay. That's an armor-piercing thing, so let's go ahead and attack. There go. I didn't really need to do that, but, you know. Whatever. Can I get a vial of blood, please? No, of course not. When I need the vial of blood, the game is like, what? Blood? Who uses that for anything? Uh, okay. Alright, that's fine. Let's eat the food. Take the eight crests and leave the citrine behind. Sorry, citrine. I don't want to camp early. But I don't really have any space for anything here. I don't want to drop seven torches. That'd be a terrible idea. So I don't know what to do. I do have... I, there is already... I do have... You know, I, you know what I didn't realize until... Like... A couple days ago? Was this item? The Okay, what? Where was that money from? I was going to say... The heirloom chest... It's, uh, the whole gimmick behind the heirloom chest is that it has heirlooms. As, you know, crests and, uh, and, and, and busts and portraits. And it's like, of course that's what it is. I, I always wondered, like, why do I seem to get more of those in those treasure chests than I do of, like, gems and things? And it's like, oh, it's because it's called the heirloom chest, you dummy. So... Yeah, there you go. Uh, okay, so it's plus 6% crit. It's not a damage buff, so... Hmm, Alright, whatever. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, just 14 damage, huh? Do you have, like... No, you don't have anything that specifically seems to... Okay, I guess that was a max damage roll then. Uh, sure, let's attack you. Get an accuracy buff. Might as well. Okay, good. And what's... What do I even want to do here? Oh, right. So close. Uh, let's just get rid of him. I want to deal with taking big damage. Because I'm not giving characters like a lot of protection items like I was before. I'm giving them more dodge bonus items. More citrine, huh? Uh, I don't want to drop five torches. Game, why? Oh, we're in a we're in a hallway. Okay. Okay, we'll leave that. It's fine. We'll camp later. Nope. I was expecting another map. I don't know why. Another shovel, huh? Okay, six hundred gold. I'm not willing to leave behind. So. Hmm. 
really hope we don't need to use that for something else later on. Guess we'll see. Hoping the answer to that is a big old no. Okay. Good start. Not a great start. I actually kind of wish that I had... Um, there was a different move that I could have given to the uh, to the shield breaker that only works when she's in the front row, but it also does that hit? Oh, it hits all four rows. Excuse me for just a second. Um, it hits all. It hits like the first. It hits like the front three rows of enemies, and it does like it doesn't. It doesn't do a huge amount of damage, but it's still. Like, it, it hits the first three rows, rows of enemies and it pushes her back one. Which probably should have been a something I should have done, rather than uh, give her the other attack. I mean, the Adder's Kiss has honestly been a pretty good attack so far. So, it's not that bad. The heal is pretty bad right there. Let's see. Okay. I'm liking this move, though. Kind of liking it. <laughs> kind of like what she's bringing to the table. I am picking up what she's putting down. Let's get rid of him. So we can't heal other enemies or cause massive amounts of stress to my team. I haven't healed yet this part, this uh, this dungeon. I probably should. I think I've taken quite a bit of damage. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I don't know which one's better. I guess it doesn't really matter which one's better. I mean, they doesn't really seem to matter which which one of those attacks I use. They're both perfectly fine in this case. Dang. That is unfortunate. That we had to wait for the bounty hunter to kill this thing. Okay, I'm running out of space. Alright. I don't want to camp, but I'm gonna. Because there's a there's a there is an oyster here. Alright, let's let's eat up. Alright, I should probably take that. <laughs> Alright. Let's do Sanctuary. We've got Nighttime Ambush. What are your abilities? I don't even know. Sandstorm. One companion can't be marked. That seems pretty cool, actually. Snake Eyes. All companions get armor piercing for four battles. That also seems quite good because there are quite a few. In, not a lot, but there are some enemies that have. that require. or that have like a lot of armor, so that's pretty cool. This is how we do it. Seems always good. Mm, what do you have? Night moves, of course. Pilfer, Snuffbox. Uh, okay. Let's do... Okay, so we have eight time. We can do night moves. We can do... This is how we do it. And we can do... Snake Eyes. I like that. I like that armor piercing thing. That seems pretty cool light, to me. Okay. Let's open up this giant oyster. We have eight shovels. It's too many shovels. For... Littering. Really? Trinkets and baubles. I think that's the worst in blood. payout I've seen from a giant oyster. 75 gold. It cost me like 250 to buy that shovel. This is not a good investment. This is not a good return on my investment game. I mean, that was probably one of the shovels that I found in here. But still, point remains. That was a terrible <laughs> reward there. Okay. How many rooms do I have? A lot. Okay. I think we're gonna plow through this area here. Which kind of sucks that there are two battles in a row, basically. But let's just plow through this area, and then we can go from there. Let's attack this guy. Wonderful. Couldn't have asked for a better start, quite honestly. And that thing's gonna die from Blight. So we can focus on... I don't actually have to... Let's just, let's just do that. Did not do as much as I hoped. Vessel, I'm counting on you. You pulled through. Very nice. Cool. That worked out quite well. No, oh, Citri. I have no space for you. Okay. You know what? I don't think we need eight torches. I hope that said eight and not six. Okay. We're good. We're good. 
All right, fishy, fishy. Three jade. Okay. Uh, this is not a good idea. But I'm doing it anyway. Oh, great, another torch. All right, sure. The match is struck. A blaze okay, we're probably going to call it born. after this fight. And I'll finish off the dungeon on the next next episode. All right, what do I want to do here? Mm, let's bring you forward. Okay. Flashing daggers. Good crit. Hmm. Who do I even want to get rid of here? I don't know. Or try to get rid of, I guess I should say. Alright, I wasn't expecting that at all. That's fine. Well done, Vestal. Okay. We've gotten rid of the worst ones. Although, we still have to deal with uh, cultists who can deal with a lot of... Okay, cool. This actually gives me a really good excuse, although I can't use the move now, I think. I'm pretty sure, because there was this... Yeah, oh, no, I can use it. Okay. So, this gives me an excuse to try out Puncture, because it bypasses... It breaks guard, which is pretty cool. So I will try that out very soon after I do this to uh, pierce the armor of that guy here. Uh, if I can, no, I don't want to. I don't want to break this. I don't want to break the armor. I don't want to stun him because I want to try this this uh, thing that they're not going to allow me to do because apparently my shield breaker suddenly has zero speed. Mm, yeah, I wasn't expecting that to do much. I just want to try this out game. Please, just let me try this out. Thank you. It, that really didn't do much damage. But we moved her up, so that's cool. That's pretty neat. Got it to work. That's pretty much all that mattered. Good. Sure. Just so she doesn't... Oh, hey! Perfect timing. More jade, more money. I, okay, twenty-five gold I can live without not taking. That's fine. Okay, that that's going this is going all right so far. So hopefully the rest of the dungeon will be okay too. Fingers crossed. I don't know, but thank you all for watching this episode of Darkest Dungeon. Please do click the like button if you enjoy the video, and subscribe to the channel. And I will talk to you all next time.